We're gonna discuss the hair in just a minute. Everyone's still asleep, even Chelsea. She might have woken up and made a peanut butter sandwich because that's the only evidence I see. <laughs> but they're all asleep and they desperately need to sleep in. Like we all went to bed at a good time last night, but they all need to sleep in. They've been waking up early with Daisy all weekend. <laughs> So I'm letting them sleep in, um, but I am just laying in bed myself, just watching videos online, <laughs> and I feel like I'm wasting my time. I feel like I could be doing all the things. Um, so about the hair, Ashley did my hair last night. She put little French, not French braids, Dutch braids in my hair, and I want to take them out and see if I like the curls. If not, I'm just going to wet it down and pull it back, but <laughs> I don't want to undo it now and like do my face and get ready for the day until I start. Not, I'm not cleaning. I'm not cleaning today. I am going to undecorate as much as I can, as quietly as I can. I will take the tree down with the ornaments off, leaving the tree picks in because those will just go into the box. I'm not getting the box down until Jason gets home because I can't touch any of that stuff. I'm just gonna take the ornaments off, take the decorations down, and I'm gonna do it in my own little pile up um, fashion under here under the counter. I don't know if I'm going to feel motivated to get the bins out and all that stuff later, but I want it all down. I want it all out of its places for right now. Um, so, I could just sit on the computer and work on the computer with my headphones and not make any noise and get that stuff done. But I'm feeling motivated right now and so I want to get, I want to just use that motivation to like do this stuff because I will have time to work on the computer later. So, the two, di two days after Christmas? Yeah, it's two days after Christmas. I'm ready to take it down. Are you guys ready? Have you guys taken yours down yet? By the time you see this, this is New Year's Day. Um, so welcome to 2024. This is how I like to start out my year, having a clean house, having organized everything in its place, Christmas put away, ready to start school. Um, so join me and hopefully when you see this, if you haven't taken Christmas down, <laughs> that it'll motivate you. So let's get started. I already started here. Uh, Patty, your Christmas um, card is going to go up. I always store all of my Christmas cards in um, the Christmas bin just to save it, but it's going to go there for now. Um, I have all of my Christmas plates from Christmas dinner back into their tin, and this tin fits in with all of my other ornaments from the tree. That It goes into that box really, really well. So I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to put them on this counter because we finally have this counter clean and I don't want to mess up this counter. So I'm gonna clear off the space here. This is like stuff that Abby didn't want in her bedroom anymore, um, a gift for a friend, and then this is like leftover Christmas stuff that needs to get sorted and put into the Christmas bins. So I need to pull this stuff out. This is obviously probably a shoe for someone. I gotta find out what um, shoe delivery I'm doing today for Jason. That always happens, <laughs> by the way put my little slippers on here, protect my feet from hurting. We're gonna get this cleared off and all of the Christmas decorations are gonna come here for now. Do you guys ever challenge yourself with how much can I hold? I've already dropped two, two of these. I think that's pretty good for one little load. Now to get it down onto the floor, which I probably will just dump it. Well, not bad. They kind of went everywhere, but that's okay. One thing I did not see a lot of was Hershey Kiss wrappers. And it's usually a sign that they didn't actually take their advent calendar kisses. Or maybe just Abby didn't. I did put a four in there. So maybe all of these are going to be for her. See, there's two in there. So they just didn't take them all. So I'm gonna empty this guy out so we don't have rotten candy next year. And we'll just put them in our little community bowl. We have our 
our tiki bowl right here. I thought I'd pull this guy out. I'm just filling her up with extra loose candy. Just leaving her on the candy counter for anyone to eat. Okay, we're gonna put her on this little tray here. My greenery is still going strong and this holly berry candle is almost done. My lighter is upstairs, but I'm gonna go get it. We're gonna finish this candle off so I don't have to store it for next year. But wood wick candles are like the only way I go now. <laughs> I love them so much, at least during the winter. I love them so much during the winter. So that's just gonna stay the way it is for now. I'll decorate it later, maybe add some fresh, real like flower flowers um, in a week or so. But for right now, we're just gonna use up this candle so I don't have to store it. Next up, this tree is definitely in the way of um, the record player on here. So it's lo looking a little bare. So I gotta figure maybe some flowers or something to go right here and another board behind or, oh, I have an idea. Um, but this guy is in the way and I'm just going to collapse him down a little bit and actually leave the light strand attached to it because it, it's cute. Then I don't have to. Oh gosh, that sounded just like Daisy. The metal <laughs> swing sounded just like Daisy. I'm like, what, why is Daisy back? Anyway, um, but I'm gonna leave the light set on this tree, but remember when you have light sets like this, take the batteries out. You don't wanna store these with your um, ornaments. It's a fire hazard. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the lights off on those and take the batteries out. Okay. Here is the status so far. I think it's pretty good. We've got just the taller things, bigger, bulkier things here. All of my nativities right here. I've got the two sleighs, kind of big things need to get wrapped up. All of the trees um, in a big bundle, along with the tree stumps and extra trees. Um, and then this whole section is all the little trinkets and tray, table, display things, ornaments. Then I've got the tree and all my linens, including this kind of stuff always gets left out at the very end. I'm putting that away so that I actually can use it next year. Um, Cause Old Navy does um, pajama pants that match that every single year and she likes to wear it. So hopefully we'll get those pants next year. She'll be able to fit into the adult sizes. And then I've just got all the lights here and just the bulkier items that need to get wrapped up. Um, the next task here, is all the ornaments and I'm kind of debating I'm kind of thinking like there's no reason I need to take these off like I don't I think they'll stay on I mean Jason can take them off if when he's taking the tree down but I'm gonna leave those on for now I'm gonna leave the tree picks in because they just go into the box that the tree goes on and so I just have these few ornaments um, to take off the tree, which should be fairly easy. And then the tree, I'm gonna have him do um, another night. I don't know if I ever showed you guys this. This is the official White House ornament of 2023. You're not gonna be able to see how great this is. I'll take it in better light, but Jason's sister, let's take this in the other room. His sister um, and husband, there you can see it. Let's get up to focus here. And that's so amazing and it's got like multiple layers to it it's absolutely stunning and then it's dedicated to certain presidents oh, there's a little white house right there and i think this one was gerald ford i think that's who it was this year um but they live in dc or they live in virginia but um i don't know why they haven't given us these ornaments in the past because i love collecting them now this is the official box that it came in and there's like a pamphlet that talks about um, the ornament and who it's like dedicated to and whatnot. Um, so super, super cool to get this from her. And um, whether they live there or not, I want her to give these. This is all I want for Christmas. I don't want anything else from their family. This is like the coolest thing ever to get from them. He's a diplomat. My brother-in-law is a diplomat, Jason's brother-in-law. And so DC and the White House, very much a part of their life. So that's a cool ornament. Okay, I'm the weird person 
OCD, I don't know, who takes ornaments off in like order <laughs> so that they can get put away in order and then put back on the tree in an organized way. I'm just weird like that. So I'm pulling them all off in specific order. Next, we'll do these wooden ones. I literally went to say pause, pause music, like this is an Alexa and it can actually pause it by itself. Are you gonna put pants on or are you going like that? Can you go brush your hair? I mean, she probably got ready for the day. This is Mabel, this is Ashley's friend. Yeah. We are going to run errands first, to be fair. Slay the errands. Slay the errands. And then where are we going? To Arena Sports. To Arena Sports. You guys are going to go play I in the arcade? Jackson Bear. What? I just want to see Jackson Bear. Well, I don't know what you're saying. Jackson Bear. I want to see Jackson Bear. What is that? The dogs. What are the dogs? Oh, what do you mean? I don't even know. <laughs> They're dogs. Oh, oh, we have to go to our friend's house and drop off a shoe. It I didn't know what you dogs. meant. I'm like, there's no dogs at, <laughs> at an arcade. I was so confused. Weird girl. Yeah. Okay, but you can't wear those slippers out. You I, have to wear real shoes. I can't wear those inside, though. What ones? The pink. You can't wear the pink ones inside. You can wear those ones outside. No, yeah, I can't actually... wear these inside, so that's why I'm wearing these inside. Okay, great. I'll go get ready. Can you get something to, real to eat? Like make yourself a peanut butter sandwich. I will take you to, that doesn't count. Hang on, I'm gonna be a mom. Okay, I'm getting ready. All I'm doing is my eyes today because it's just not worth anything more. But Ashley put these braids in last night, like I said. I don't know if we're gonna keep it down. I get pretty self-conscious when I see curls. I don't know why. Like not made, like not me made curls. No, I'm almost done. I'm just doing my hair. Are you wanting to sit down? Yeah. What if I made like a double table here? Or Would you guys use it? Not that often. Not that often? You're just wanting to sit down now? Yeah, and she's in there. Oh, Abby's in there. Okay, let me just finish my hair real quick. Yeah. Are you just wanting to sit down and do your hair? Or your makeup, I mean? Yeah. Okay. Alright, well. I have been thinking about adding another table. I have one underneath the stairs. Ashley has been sitting down here and I can't stand her mess. So, I've been thinking about doing something. Well, I don't know. Let me see what I think, what I can do with it. It'll probably get pulled up, if I'm not lying. But it felt really good when she did my hair last night, so that counts for something. It was a hard no on the curls. It didn't really work out so well. <laughs> um, so, it's okay. I, it is what it is. I'm not really like in this for like the nice outfit. Clearly, I'm wearing a sweatshirt and t-shirt. Okay, I'm gonna go. Also, really quick, I know I'm leaving this mess here. The kids are very used to it. <laughs> I get motivated for sec different sections of um, decorating and undecorating. So I got to this point and now I don't need to be motivated for the other part for another day or two. So it is what it is. No one gets into it, no one messes with it, so I wish it was more tucked back in, but it is what it is. Yeah. All right, <laughs> so um, Arena Sports was kind of a bust because Ashley didn't have very much money on her card. And a rip off. You only had to, yeah, it's, a, it's a rip off, which is why we try and use gift cards from other people. <laughs> So, we're just trying to find some fun things to do. So we're at Sephora. She's obsessed with like makeup. I just went and turned in Kaylee's old phone to Verizon. We, I have a phone holder for my phone. We, hours ago, my battery, or not my battery, my. Oh my, what am I saying? The file, I ran out of footage on this disc. Storage. Storage, yes. I don't have all the words. Hi. So I couldn't use this camera. Thank you. This is where we're at in our day. Thank you. Just put that one there. You can hold your chocolate milk. So we went to Target. Ashley, do you want to? No, that's a Sprite. Oh, is that water? Yeah. Um, we'll tell you what we've been doing <laughs> without a camera. And when um, I go and what you got. We went um, and roamed around Starbucks. I don't know when 
the footage stopped. At Starbucks. Sephora. So we went and I think right about the time my um thank you. Kids meal. It is the is it Squishmallow. the Squishmallow? Yeah. It doesn't say anything on the outside or does it? Oh yeah, right there. She wanted to see what Squishmallow she could get. I got I my get grimace. Storage ran out right grimace. when we went into Sephora. You can, Grimace is the mystery one, I think. No, Grimace is right there. Is there an actual Grimace one? No, no, that's Grimace. That's it. So that's a mystery. Yeah, that looks exactly like We'll find out. Um, thank you. So, sorry, long story short, we looked in, in Sephora, and even though I don't have a gift card for Sephora, I have, I got a, an Ulta gift card from Jason. We still want to remember. And I know I'm going to go get, what is it called again? Sol de Janeiro perfume. Thank well, you. Yes. Yeah. But. And um, I, so that I decided what perfume I'm going to go and get. 72. What is it? 72. 72? Is that the one I want? No, 71. And then we walked over to Target and roamed the beauty aisle. And if you don't know this, it'll be too late by the time you see this. But... A lot of people do holiday clearance in the holiday section but look in like the beauty supply section look in the home section because anything marked with any kind of holiday decor any kind of candy cane peppermint yeah. pine tree is deemed um, holiday and it'll be on whatever clearance price for holiday so we got like yeah we mascara, were getting we got yeah I was getting mascara got I got some color pop uh, Maybelline and um, two dollar nails. We're waiting. We're gonna wait on that body scrub. Yeah. We'll go back for the Tree Hut body scrub when it goes to seventy percent off. It was only fifty percent off, which is still a great deal. But it was going. But it will. It will go 70. to seventy because the back side of the sign said seventy. So I know it's gonna go soon. And so we'll go back, like, we got a bunch of stuff at Target, including. You wanna show them your nails? Show them your nails. She got some fake nails for, she My told friend. me it was two dollars. Mine were. And actually rang, oh yeah, yours were, but Mabel got some and they were four dollars. But still, it's a pretty good deal. What the heck is that? I don't know. Oh, it's a Hummer. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I am hands-free. I do have an actual car attachment for my phone phone in this car, which is actually really cool. I like it a lot. So then we went. Yes, I get to do something. Can you just sat on the couch? I sat on the couch for 10 minutes, girl. We only had an hour no, before we had to take Mabel home. And then we got we her see? some... Yeah, see what Squishmallow you got. See which one you got. It's going to be earth shattering. I can't I twist can't the it. camera to can't show her. Open it. Goodness sakes, girl. I already hate Do you even see her? You oh, can't right see here. her. Gosh. All right. I have it in my hand. Which one is it, Ash? Okay. Open it. You can hold it if you want. Oh, it is. What is it? Gordon. Show it. Show it to them. Gordon. It's oh, it Gordon. has a mini tag. So. It has a mini tag. It's 530. Jason's probably just leaving work, but he is going to visit his brother in the hospital. His brother's really lonely. His wife and kids are going to see him, but that gets, you know, it's just not quite enough. So he's going to go spend a couple of, maybe an hour or two with him, just kind of hang out, talk. Um, his other brother might go and visit as well. He's still in town. And I need to just go home and get some stuff done. I'm working on a holiday bonus project for one of our staff members. Not yeah, really going to talk gonna about go it. Home and help. I know I was going to go and work on that, but. We're giving the gift of experience for experiences for one of our staff members. So 
I got to go work on that experience um, and get some other stuff done. So I had a lot of fun with them and I'm sad that I didn't have a camera that was working when we were out playing with them because Mabel can be on camera and she's just kind of a kook. She's just kind of fun to be she's with. She's just Mabel. She's just Mabel. She's just fun to be around. She's a girly girl. Very. Very girly girl. And you would think in a household of all of us girls, she's way more girly girl. Maybe she's just more vocal about it. I don't know. Well, yeah. Okay, Ashley, what have you done? Target. I'm sleeping. Yeah. So this is the bag we got at Target. Yeah. Right? It's clear. Clear. She's going to put all of her cheer stuff, bathroom stuff in it, right? Yeah. Show us what's in there. Deodorant. Hair stuff. Like, all the that's for like your got. part. Yeah. Yep. For her slick back. Wow. And that's, this is what she got for Christmas. This is the hair wax. There's some in my um, office drawer, chest. Hair wax. Okay. And uh, more brushes. Yep. And even more makeup brushes. Makeup brushes. We got those at Target today, right? Uh, the red ones we did. The elf ones I got for. Yeah, the elf ones you got for Christmas. Yeah. And then I got you some more. I might actually borrow some of those. <laughs> okay. Um, eyeshadow. Yep. Got and those blush. ones for Christmas. It's okay. fine. Um, ponytails. Perfect. Mascara and an eyelash curler. And an eye curler. An eyelash curler. Yep. And then hand sanitizer. Where'd you get that from? The mall. Oh, that's what you got with yeah. Mabel. Okay. Awesome. Okay. Actually put, put it all it back in, in there. And it's going to go back in there every time so you don't lose track of where all your stuff is. Right? All right. So, how you doing? Dana wanted me to give you an update on what I've been doing the last couple nights since Christmas. And it's pretty cool. <laughs> so I have been working on this. Little servos, little suspension. Let's see if I set this up right. So you've got little articulating suspension all around. Got the back. The back there kind of goes up and down. You know what I'm saying? Got some suspension. Got the motors. Some batteries go in there. Anyways, it's been fun. I'm just now getting to where I'm building up the uh, the upper carriage part, where I think the shell will start to go around it, make it look more like a car. The alignment looks straight now. Uh, I don't know, trying to figure out the gears and everything, but it's been way fun. It's been a lot of work, but uh, we'll see how it goes when it starts running. Hope you're having fun watching the videos. Hope you guys all have a great, or I hope you had a great Christmas, and I hope you have a wonderful New Year. Hope all is as you desire, and here's to a good 2024.